have to head back to 1896, the last time Scotland won four in a row in the Calcutta Cup in this championship. What's it like to be history boys? Um, to be honest, I didn't even know that until two minutes ago. So, like, it's great to, for us to to be the team that have you know achieved quite a bit or achieved a few records. You know, winning a, a down in, in Wales, beating England in, in Twickenham, beating France over there. So we've done a lot of. Uh, I had a lot of good results, but there's still a long way to go, and I think that's uh, the best bit about it. We're not getting too ahead of ourselves, um, and it's been, I suppose, a long time coming, some would say. So I've been here with Scotland for almost 10 years now when we lost by 60 points down in England, or you'd lose by a point up here. So it's nice to be on the other side of it for the last few years. Look, we all know your rugby's Lionel Messi, right? But do you think you get enough credit for your goal kicking? Flawless today, six out of six, 15 points on the board. Yeah, it's been good uh, this tournament. Um, I've been struggling a bit with it at Bath, so I don't know what, what the owner of Bath's going to say when I, when I come up here and kick every kick, but down there I'm struggling about 60%. But no, it's, um, oh, it's great for the team, I think. Me being, being able to knock the points over, keep the scoreboard ticking and, and keep England at arm, arm's length. After the disappointment of, of losing to France and also the manner in which you lost that game, what does it say about this squad that you've been able to come back today and chalk up yet another win over England? Look, I think it's brilliant. I think we had a really professional week building up to this game. We got over a loss to France. It was quite a, t a tricky week to know if we approached this week after a defeat or after a game that we should have won. It was hard. Um, but the professionalism of everyone, uh, players, coaches, staff, everyone, it was brilliant this week. And, you know, we managed to beat a really good England side today. Um, I think the, the most frustrating thing about the France game will be if, if we do manage to go to Italy and get a win, then... We'll be looking back at that game pretty frustrated, but um, that's sport and these things happen. So for us, we just had to do our job this week and, and today to build up for uh, the Italy game in two weeks' time and then hopefully go over there and do a professional job as well. Great job. Well done. Thank you. Thank you.